Have you ever wondered why Java sometimes say two integers are equal and sometimes it doesn't, even when they have the same value? Today we are diving into a quirky behavior of Java's integer class that often confuses both beginners and experienced programmers. We will explore why this is true, but this is false. In Java, integer is a wrapper class for the primitive int type. When we create integer objects, Java doesn't always create new objects in memory. This is where things get tricky and it's a common source of bugs for Java developers. In Java, we know that double equal operator used to compare object references, not the actual values of objects. But in our case, 9 and 900, both seems to be an object references, right? No. In case of integer, there is a concept of auto boxing and caching which take place. So when I do integer a is equal to 100, Java treats this expression as integer a is equal to integer dot value of 100. And if I go to implementation of value of, I see something interesting. Hmm. For certain integers, Java returns cached value. And what those are? Let's see. Okay. So if my integer is in the range of minus 128 to 127, it will always be cached. That's why when I compare 9, which is in range, it gives me cached value. But in case of 900, it always create new object. So remember, no matter what kind of integer with i in caps you are comparing, Always, always, always use dot equals method to avoid any issues in future. Thanks for joining me on this deep dive into Java's integer. If you enjoyed this explanation, hit that subscribe button for more such insights. 